What's up guys? Team Adonix around the country. This is your boy IBB Pro Aided Market. So uh, four days out as of today. Um, weight is the same but look even tighter this morning. Um, as you can see a lot drier, a lot more definition and this is really where we need to be. Try to zoom in here so you can see very dry. So This is good and we're still on two gallons of water. So two gallons of water and looking pretty damn dry and I haven't cut any sodium at all. So today I'm gonna get down even more. I'm gonna do uh, two days um, of 30 grams of carbs. So today and tomorrow. Um, and then also gonna keep the protein at 220, 225 and fats very low, 25 to 45. Um, in terms of the workout today, is really meant to get rid of all the glycogen. So after every few sets, doing primarily back um, and maybe some, some biceps, but after every couple of sets, we're actually gonna do five minutes of high intensity interval training. And uh, that's gonna help get rid of all of the glycogen, um, get me down even more. I'm gonna be flat, I already know that, but that's the purpose of carving back up on Friday and, and maybe even Thursday. So this is where we are guys. I'll tune back in with you. Um, a little bit later today. Peace. What up, what up, is your boy. So, this is how it goes down. We're four days out, guys. And uh, this is my absolute last workout for the week. I want to make sure it's called peak week. So, the reason it's called peak week is because you want to make sure within the next, within that last seven to 10 days, you do everything right. So, when you hit the stage, you're at your peak. So, this is my absolute last workout. A lot of people don't do it like this, but four days out, what I do is a workout that includes my cardio in between my sets. So we hit stairs to start. Every two sets that we do, we do a drop set for every single thing, three drops, and then we come back do five minutes of cardio in between. Um, we got a total of about eight. So eight to seven sets. So you're looking at 35 to 40 minutes of cardio. The idea is to get the glycogen levels down almost to zero by the end of the day. My carbs are super low, so carbs are super low. And with this type of workout being that everything is a circuit, the glycogen levels will be super low and uh, get as lean as we can today. Tomorrow might do some cardio, that's it. But like I said, no more strength training throughout the whole week. All right. So, first super set you notice, we're doing four sets, pull ups, alternating from rear, wide, chins, and then we're gonna end up rear again. We were between eight to 12 reps, back to back. Keep in mind, really low carbs, 30 grams max. So, so far I have about 15 grams in me. Might do another 15 grams later today, and that's it. 
So again, you'll notice I'm a lot leaner. Every day get leaner and leaner. So, look pretty good. Energy is super low, but gotta keep hitting it. That's what we need. Another thing you notice, everything is a drop set, three drop sets. Start fairly heavy, 12 reps. Drop it down one or two notches, another 10 to 12, and drop it again. These workouts are not meant to build muscle. So it's for conditioning purposes only. Just get those extra, extra definition that we're gonna need when you hit the stage and get that extra body fat off. Here we go, now time to hit the stairs again.
All right, guys. So that was a bitch. So anyway, we got five out of seven of our supersets in, including the stairs on each one, five minutes. And uh, we still have two more left. So I'm gonna come back later this evening um, and finish those last two. They're smaller body parts. So I'm gonna hit hyper extensions and calves, superset those with some stairs, some more. And then also, um, I'm gonna hit arms, so biceps and tries, and then that's it for today. So, awesome workout. It was very tiring. I'm sure I burned a lot of calories today, and uh, I'm gonna have a, a protein shake and um, just a little bit. Probably had to rest of my carbs for the day right now after the workout, and uh, eat in about an hour. Or so, I'll check back in with you guys later. We might do a little bit of posing practice too. But uh, thanks for tuning in. Hopefully these uh, videos have helped a little bit. I know when I was prepping, it was very hard to get a lot of information. People were giving you bits and pieces, so just wanted to put this together. I know it wasn't the best video quality. Um, don't have a huge production staff or anything like that, so you know, I just put this together. Hopefully it can help some of you guys who are starting out uh, in bodybuilding or men's physique, so you have an idea of what goes into prep. All right guys, talk to you a little bit later. Peace. All right guys, so 